But I think to be clear, saying that uh, the visits to Taiwan should not provoke military drills or ballistic missile launches are uh, not being used as an occasion to intimidate. Certainly, China has been toughening its stance on Taiwan. We have seen repeated incursions of Chinese planes across the median line of the strait, missiles flying over the island, some even landing in Japan's economic zone. China has also issued a new white paper on Taiwan, which certainly changes certain parameters for an eventual reunification process. We continue saying the same thing, to preserve peace, stability, and the status quo in the Taiwan Strait is a key, not just for the security and prosperity of the region, but also for our. This has naturally led the European Union to value even more our partnership with Taiwan, to broaden our cooperation with Taiwan, to modernize our dialogue with Taiwan. But all of it in the framework of one China policy. The threat of use of force to change the status quo is not acceptable. That the status quo has to be preserved and is therefore key to manage tensions in a way that there is not an open conflict.